Lots of good high school volleyball teams in our area. A pair of teams picked in the coaches' preseason top 10 poll squared off. Let's show you some highlights. Carterville picked seventh, hosting second ranked Fairfield. Now the Mules took the first set, and this was a great volleying session right here in the second. Carterville's Amanda Howerton thinks she had a winner. Emerson Robbins kept it alive. The Mules' McKenna Reed had a thunderous shot. Then the Lions' Taylor Wallace denied the score. This went back and forth. Carterville gets it back over. Fairfield regroups, and Robbins had the kill shot. Fairfield would go on to close out the second set, and the Mules get a tough road win. Fairfield wins in straight sets. Boys soccer, Centralia at Carbondale, no score. Orphans threatening, and Alex Van Winkle, no relation to Rip. Terrier's keeper is wide awake, alertly makes the big save. And with seven minutes left in the half, the Terriers capitalize on a pair of Orphans miss hits. Luca DiMaggio sends it to the back of the net. Terriers go on to win two to one. Another boys soccer score for you, Pinckneyville blanks Massac County, one to nothing. Back to volleyball, Pinckneyville improves the 3-0, making quick work of West Frankfurt. 4-1 Marion gets by Gallatin County in straight sets. 4-0 Woodlawn knocks off Oakwaville and Weber outlasts El Verado. Ziegler Royalton needs just two sets to get by El Dorado, and hopefully that catches you up on all the local volleyball scores.